Hi, I'm Chris the Entertainment and Bisco, and you're going, we're going to be talking about bringing back the Entertainment Man Talk Show, Pre-Toronto Islands Event Part 1. There's three parts to the tonight's, uh, three-part series. Uh, we have a lot to talk about. I can hear an echo in the background, or is that just a speaker, maybe? I don't know. Uh, what did, first question, as it said in the beginning of the video, said, what, so, uh, what, made me decide to do uh, this event to bring back the show? Well, I've been thinking about the show a lot. It's been no vote, hmm, about a year now that we haven't. June 12th is actually the official day we filmed our last episode. But, as you know, July was our last episode. So August, it was in August, sorry, it was in August. And then, so we decided that we would uh, do an event that would help us bring it back reintroduce you guys to the show four seasons it's going to be four seasons uh, next summer we are going to be back J uh, July 2012 15 episodes starting in July run until June and then we'll have summer off they will be running it in the fall again at their normal 13 episodes later on there will be a season where we'll have 15, 16 episodes but that will be later on but I want to do this event to help remember this uh, show from it running uh, about a year ago. It's been three years since uh, we since it started, and now we want to recognize the show for it being coming back next summer. So I'm looking forward to it, and that's why I want to do this event to get you guys re focused back on the show because that show hasn't been in run in over almost a year now. So we want to get you guys familiarized with the show once again. Now what kind of events are we going to have that bring us back to the entertainment talk show? Well, we're going to be having a skipple tournament. I maybe will be broadcasting some of the entertainment man talk show episodes up on our on the TV during the event so, you, so the uh, people are involved with the uh, event will get to see some episodes that they've never seen, like the 50th episode or the final episode of the Entertainment Man Talk Show, season three, or even season one, episode one, where I first started the show. Uh, so we're gonna do that. Also, we're gonna do a bowling, uh, like a bowling fundraiser, hopefully this fall. And I'm sure Brent will want to come and be involved with it. And, uh, I'm sure he wants to. He'll want to call the filming. The more we film events, the more pictures we take, that's going to get the show more recognized and the team more recognized as well as we are starting to have our new t-shirts. I kind of screwed up on mine, but you know what? This is just the start of one. I will make one later on. So we have the bowling, the, uh, bowling fundraiser coming up probably in the fall, winter, early new year. We'll be working on that. Uh, what made you think? to be done before July 2012 next year. We have a lot of things to do. We may be, we might uh, be doing Entertainment Man Talk Show t-shirts again, uh, probably with the most recent logo we have as well, but all the cast and crew will be getting one. Brent, Dave, myself, uh, Justin Milner, he's our volunteer. He'll be in and out of the set for that one. He'll always be there to help out, and he's going to help me paint the set as well. That's another thing we have to do is paint the set, as you saw, or you will see in the uh, live event, of the, the um, behind the scenes. We don't have the full background done yet. That is still work in progress. We are hoping to get that done either this summer or the next summer. We are hoping to get it done soon as possible as well. Um, there's still plans to make. We still need to make plans, uh, research locations. We need to uh, do some research, start script writing for the next year. We're going to have a big thick booklet full of it, but I think we're going to split the scripts up. I will print off like 10 or 20 copies per script. So we're going to have a lot of paper involved with the script writing and all that. And we are also looking for a co-host. So you live in the current region, you want to become a co-host, go for it. Uh, email me at 
chrisfiscal.tvpt at gmail.com. It's on your screen. Uh, if you want to apply, right now would be the best, best to start applying for the Entertainment Man Talk Show. Co-hold role. We are hiring right now. Uh, auditions will be held in December over our my break from school and Brent's break from school. So, then in your, uh, you love to be in front of the camera, you love talking like I do, you want to be my co-host and have some fun, come out and travel around Durham region, go to Toronto when we have the money to. Then in your applications, I will be putting an application up on the Entertainment Man Talk Show page of the website either tonight or tomorrow uh, night I will be putting it up uh, so send in your application sign up and uh, just I hope to see you at auditions I will give you an email or a call and I will let you know if you are like when your uh, casting call is well like audition uh, time is and where as well. Brent will be there to be one of the judges as well. And that's about it. Stay tuned for our next episode coming up next. Thanks for listening. We'll see you